Hey, this is Melissa Fleur with ProjectNursery.com. I am going to share with you a little girl's nursery that I would move into as an adult. Okay, I know that sounded a little strange, but this room is so beautiful. It's little Emmeline's nursery out of Houston, Texas, and what's so unique about it is the color palette. The color palette is gray, beautiful, soft, almost a creamy gray wall, uh, accented with teal, turquoise, aqua, and Quite honestly, it's not the color scheme I would choose for a little girl. It's a color scheme I would choose for myself. It's, it is just beautiful and I think it works. The floral pattern is what makes it feminine and uh, thanks to grandma and uh, her handmade goodness, she went ahead and created the drapes along with the bedding as well as the darling elephant mobile and the elephant art hung above the crib. So there you get that baby nursery elephant theme without being too baby. Uh, my favorite item in the room has to be the orb chandelier. That orb chandelier is from Ballard Designs. I've seen it in dining rooms, I've seen it in living rooms, I've yet to see it in a nursery, and it totally works. Amazing job, mom and dad. Another area to focus on in the room is the reading nook. Uh, great job using the picture rails to showcase each of the books for baby. As for the furniture in this room, starting with the crib, we're looking at a land of nod, a straight up crib. So it has very clean, simple lines, again, very gender neutral uh, and it's coupled with the Land of Nod Blake dresser and nightstand which was accented with restoration hardware knob so it's fun to kind of uh, play up a simple piece of furniture with a little crystal. The leaning shelf from Crate and Barrel also offers a nice uh, area to display um, some decorative accessories and of course there is the glider which is created by Little Castle. I want to point out something also really special. The alphabet wall showcased in Emmeline's nursery. Now we've seen a ton of alphabet walls. Uh, it's definitely a trend and nurseries, but this one is done so beautifully. And the inspiration came from Jenny Bullen Studio Inspiration.blogspot.com. So we'll put the link up so you can check it out. But it's beautifully done. You did an incredible job in creating a beautiful, elegant nursery for your little girl to grow in. Uh, congratulations, and thank you for allowing us to share it on room tours. For more great nurseries, visit ProjectNursery.com and don't forget to like us on Facebook. We'll see you again next week. Thanks.